That wasn't a warning. as it comes.
Shaman, you're trying to understand the machines here too? Yes, Nora. And taking my time with my studies. Between you, me, and the spirits, I appreciate the peace. Not just from the machines. There are many changes in Ban Ur. The hunters and shamans bicker without end. What about? How best to deal with a harsher world. The hunters, they don't want it back the way it used to be. And we shamans find ourselves able to explain less and less. So many are exiles now, sent to wander. Here, no one argues. So, I welcome mystery. Greetings, Nora. I am Tikuk. Shaman. I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> the blue light is strong here. My people traveled far from the heights of Ban Ur to experience it for themselves. The blue light? The light of the machine spirits. It is all around us. It settles upon us. This is how it used to be, before they grew angry. I... I know about the derangement, but I didn't think the machines were ever this calm. What is it about this place? We don't really know. We sing, and we listen to the machine songs. Teacook, have any other Outlanders come through here recently? Some Asaram, yes. They were convinced the machines were malfunctioning. As if machines were mere devices in need of repair. Well, that is how the Asaram see the world, is it not? They ate with us. Then, when they were satisfied there was nothing they could explain, they left with the Northern Light. The machines... sing to you? To each other. You are a hunter. You must have heard. Their communions and hymns, their calls and cries. We're not meant to understand, but we shamans try to interpret. What is the song that angered them so, that turned them upon us? What song soothes them? Does it thrum in the air here, just outside of hearing? How can we heal the machine world? What's with the big guy? I was drawn to this place in a storm. At first, I thought the keening was the wind, snapping off the mountain's frozen face. But no, it was the Thunder Jaws song. I found it crouched on its haunches, its metal unmoving, and I took shelter beneath it. When the storm cleared, its singing done, perhaps the spirit left its great shell, or perhaps it slumbers and remains. So we have not stripped and gleaned this one. We treat it with the care it is owed. Do you mind if I look around more, Tikuk? Speak, trade, listen. You are welcome. No harm will come to you here. So it's not the Banuk that are doing this. There's something about this place. They can't see it, but maybe my focus can. So 
to let women rule, but only if they're worthy. There, a signal. And the source is at the top of the mountain. I'd better look into it. This is how the Banuk must have gotten up and down the mountain. from melted snow. Chuff skulls. The slack was on your end. I think it's okay. Looks like it's okay, doesn't it? It's only split in half. Get away with that smoke. It's burned out. What have you done? Who are you? You're not one of those Banuk. <sighs> Too late. Let me look at it. Hold on, hold on. This was our delve. We did the work. You want to put your axe in? What's this thing worth to you? I don't know about this. This was your idea. You started it, you can finish. All right. Could be this thing's just scrap, but even scrap has a price. So I'll ask again, what's it worth to you? It's worth more to me than you are. You still want to negotiate? Forget it. All you've ever given me is black toes. <sighs> They've made a mess of this. Catastrophic malfunction. This is from long ago. And it's been sending a signal all this time. Fading out. I have to get back to the camp. Before the machines tear it apart. They've already started attacking. The hunt is back. The machines are angry. Keep your distance. Hunters, defend the camp. Yes. Do what you must. Roar and rend at me. I don't fear it. My song machine, a sharp song. Nora, did you know this change would come upon us? Not exactly. Although I know there is a lot changing in our world. This time it was outsiders. Those Asaram thought. The Asaram do not think. They will never understand the balance between us. Between man and machine. Now the blue light has gone. And we are left with many songs. 
but more for mourning than gratitude. So what now? Will you go back to your homeland? When we teach the young to walk on shifting ice, we say, the secret is taking one step, then the next. Perhaps one day, we will understand the machine's mysteries. I hope so. Good luck, T. Cook. Now you'll hear my song, machine. A sharp song. 